good evening this is almost six o'clock good evening friends good evening everyone beauties handsome good evening welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel you're on with the beauty misty they call me the beauty misty and um, you're welcome highly welcome uh, thank you very much for clicking on this video if you're new please do not forget to click on the subscription button subscribe to this channel and as well activate the, uh, the bell button so that whenever I upload my video you will be the first to be notified all right and to my already followers now nah, you know now nah, you know how we do it we do it like this thank you <laughs> well guys I'll try to be very slow in this video while talking and I want to tell you guys what I want to do for you guys today now this is a very special video and it's very special a recipe I want to make this number one this very recipe it has been in my notes for a very long time it has been in my heart to make it and show you guys but I was waiting I actually wanted to make this very recipe on as soon as I have um 10,000 subscribers but however we will always improvise as time goes by so if you're watching this video this time around you're one of the lucky people all right so this very video i want to make today is a very beautiful soup sexy this soup is sexy this soup is sexy this soup is sweet this soup is selegance this soup is sumptuous this soup is sequestence this soup is sagalicious anything <laughs> you want to call it at the end of the day it's have some assistance inside of it so this stuff i want to make today is very sweet and sexy and succulent so so anything okay so i want to do it this way like i wanted to make this soap for um for you guys but i want to give it out a friend as a gift i also want to be you know giving out some getting out some one to one to from it but the way I'm making this soup today is a little bit on a higher tone. Next time it's going to be more on a higher tone. Normally you can make it on a, a step down to what I'm making it today. A step down to what I'm making it today. Okay. So yeah, the soup can be made in different forms. It's a very sweet, sexy, beautiful, sassy, beautiful, sexy soup. <laughs> I'm looking for the word to call, what name to call this soup. So mind you, my children, they are around and their father is sleeping and these children can't let me rest. Like I can't, I can't. So I don't, I don't get a rest. Like I don't get a rest with these children. I, I think I'm looking for where to send. I don't know if they can go for all this like for two weeks so that I can have some rest. <sighs> Motherhood is not easy. So let's continue to with our sexy, sexy, sexy sexy so <laughs> all right <laughs> let me in fact introduce i don't want to say too much but let me introduce you guys today I don't i don't have the time to introduce but let's start let's start be this beautiful soap okay so let's dig in go to the let's turn to the working table <laughs> let's turn to the working table am i is my eye looking at you now i can't understand i'm looking i love i love looking at my face but i love looking at you so let's do that so for this soap we are making now this soap is let me just introduce what this soap is going to be doing this soap is going to be number one major is that it's going to be exfoliating peeling moisturizing moisturizing is as well as softening okay so moisturizing slash softening whitening the skin and glowing the skin that is what this soap is going to be doing for us that is what this soap is going to do what be doing for us and at the end of the day it is super sexy soap so this what i have here is my goat meat oh, <laughs> goat milk soap this is my goat milk soap base which i have shredded and then another one i'm going to be using is my color ozone soap so I'm going to be using one of color ozone soap. So 
So I just shredded my color ozone soap. So I'm going to be adding my color ozone soap. I just want to use a small bowl. I don't want to use a very big bowl. Just wish everything will be fine. I hope everything will be fine, right? Should I use a bigger bowl? Hmm. Maybe I should use a bigger bowl. Alright, let's get a bigger bowl. Let's get something bigger. So, I just got a bigger bowl. Okay, so it's to be sterilized, okay? Always make sure your working environment is sterilized. So that when you pick in some things, there won't be any fear. Somehow, um, somehow the table is going to be messy today. But just bear with me. So this is the soap. I decided to add because I had one, uh, one um, goat milk soap. So I didn't finish that one. So I decided to add more of the goat milk. Just finish one of that soap. Okay. So the next ingredient we're going to be adding. Let me show you guys because of space. Is my, um, you know, you guys know this. This is my rose petal. Oh, this is table is a mess. My rose petals. So the next ingredient we're going to be adding is my rose petals. So I'm going to show you guys how I did it. What I would do. So this is my rose petal. I add, I, I put it in this blender. And then I'm going to be blending it. I was blending it but I said, let me just finish the blending here. Sorry. Um, sorry guys, let me just blend it. So this is it, rose petals powder, rose, pet rose petals blended, grinded. Now we're going to be adding whitening powders to this. Now this very soap, thing, as if you're a formulator, you can make it any way you want to make it though. You can add Filipino set powder to it though. Me now, I want to add my snow white powder. My snow white powder this is a modeling mask okay professional use this is a teaspoon two teaspoons i like being notorious with my ingredients so so i'm gonna be adding four teaspoons with my of my snow white powder The next powder I want to add is my glutathione glutathione powder. I just emptied it in this container. I like being notorious in my powders in my ingredients. I want that you know this so using it you will see your results you know so i'm adding so i added 20 ml of the glutathione powder be notorious with your own ingredients <laughs> 
another product I'm going to be adding. I'm first of all, adding all the powders. I'm going to be adding malic acid powder. Malic acid powder. My space is small. So. Malic acid powder. I'm going to be doing 10 ml of malic acid powder. I'm going to be adding my salicylic acid, which normally should be blended with the propylene glycol. But for me, I'm making a soap. So it's okay even if I get the granules. Is it is it called granules? Like I don't know the English word though. Mm. When the thing is not properly very smooth. Granules or granules, I don't know. Yes, I'm listening. I'm going to be adding this measurement, but what I'll do because salicylic powder sometimes looks appears to be, you know, somehow freezed. I don't know. So I'll just use my hand to smash it properly. I hope you guys are seeing this. So, I hope you guys are seeing this video very well. I hope you guys are seeing this. Huh? Salicylic acid powder for that exfoliating effect. Now, this soap, like I said, you can do anything you want to do with this very soap. Play with it as much as you want. I'm going to be adding my lactic acid. I'll do one tablespoon of lactic acid. It's going to as well peel your skin, this soap. The next ingredient I want to add is my glycolic acid. Glycolic acid, I'll just be doing um, 5 ml of glycolic acid. So, we just have to, you know, just mix it up gradually let's just mix it up gradually mix it up so We will continue. The next ingredient we're going to be adding is our bamboo serum, which is the same thing as you have uh, the what's it called? The oh god, what's that? So our bamboo um, serum, bamboo serum is the same thing as this one. This is also this is bamboo. This is bamboo. It's the same thing as stretch firm water. It's a bamboo stretch uh, firm water. So this one is in more of a liquid kind of toner. I use it as a toner. And this one as well, I use it as also on my face as a serum. 
this is very 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 nice i always talk about it this is very very nice i instead of aloe vera i have aloe vera but i don't use aloe vera anymore i use bamboo because bamboo is more better i sell it as well if you need it i sell it as well i sell the bamboo as well it's very nice so we're going to be adding it into this very recipe It's a gel. And it smells very nice. It's, a, it's very nice. You can rub it. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know I was I didn't press this thing. So um I just added the gel, that aloe vera um bamboo gel, which is very great, guys. Every woman need that bamboo in, in her life. Every woman, every woman, every mother need a bamboo in her life. You know, this is a vitamin E. I'll be adding vitamin E. I will not add too much on it. Every woman need a bamboo in her life. If you've given birth before and your stomach is some kind of uh, saggy, it, this gel can help to firm your your saggy stomach or your saggy hands or your saggy breast. Um, it helps to firm the skin. It's very very nice that bamboo. You need it. I sell it as well And it's very great. So the ink next ingredient is going to be our frankincense oil essential oil, so I'm gonna do one two three four five six I'm gonna do 15 or 20 drops. Let me see Ten, eight, nine. Okay, let's just keep it at this amount. So you can decide to add more powders to this very recipe. So now another powder that I actually forgot to. I was trying to open it, but I later forgot. Another powder I want to add to this because I want it to get that deep moisturizing feeling. I'm going to be adding alantion to this very. It is very uh, so. So I'm going to be adding. Uh, this is alantian, okay. I'm going to be adding. I need it to get, I need it to like, when you apply it on your skin, after it spews, then your skin will be very soft, like that of okra. You get what I mean? So, again, we will, this soap, we need to make it a little more liquid. So, we're going to be adding distilled water to this recipe. We don't want to add too much water to this so because we don't want it to be like a wash so we want to add distilled water into it let me see what a cup of distilled what a cup of distilled water can do so this is distilled water sorry i'm going to show you guys it's my distilled so this is my distilled water i'm going to be adding a cup who is that oh jesus my children don't worry so I'm going to be adding the last two water into this thing. Let's see how, how many, I don't want it to be true. Kiona, Kiona, make sure you don't go to my office. Don't go into my office, okay? So we'll leave it and uh, allow it to soak very well.
so we are not done yet we, we we want to make this colorful like this color is a little bit purple which is great because of the um the rose petals are added into it so as you can see it looks very beautiful already so but i still want to add a little bit of coloring to it so guys we're gonna let this soap to stay here soften um the ingredients blends in together then we will now continue uh, we will now blend it together and bottle it well i hope this is sexy enough i hope you love the sexiness sexiness of this very soap because as sexy as it looks it's also gonna be super sexy and sexy and sexy on the skin i hope you're loving it already i hope you want to try that like as i'm talking the fragrance is getting into my into me and i'm feeling like almost falling asleep like this is giving me a natural yoga yoga jeez me an english this is giving me a natural yoga I'm feeling it already. It's sending sensations through my nose, into my medulla, and down through the veins of my bones. <laughs> and I'm feeling some sensations inside of my body. This is what this soap is doing to me right now. And trust me, you will love this soap. And one thing is this. This soap for those of you that that's looking for small small things to be you know to make money from you see the oil you see the malaysian oil i made for you you see the pimento oil the paprika oil i made that paprika oil is super duper it's so nice you see this recipe is so nice you can make it and start selling from it there's also another mask i made that mask is great so these are small small things that doesn't really cost you much that you can give to people you can sell to people and they will love it trust me so let's wait and see the end result of this very soap see you guys again as soon as this soap is ready thank you stay tuned so this is our sexy soap our sexy soap now there are in this juncture or on this juncture <laughs> there are so many things you can do you can decide to add you can decide to add um, exfoliating maybe spa salts or Himalayan salts or sugar you can decide to add it if you did not add salicylic acid and um, and uh, glycolic, you can decide to not add glycolic acid. If you don't have glycolic acid and salicylic acid or this uh, malic acid and the lactic acid, if you don't have them, just make the soap the same way I made it. And then you add um, um, maybe Epsom salt or Himalayan salt or any spa salt you can look for any spa salt that have uh, that is rose in color and add it to it do you understand so that it will help to uh, you know so that it will give the exfoliating um, effect but these other ones we added like the salicylic is going to be exfoliating but it's not the rough uh, exfoliating you understand it's going to be peeling but not the rough uh, method of uh, exfoliating you understand so so this is this is it. Oh my god, it smells so good. 
Now, another thing I want to teach us is this. Now, for example, if you feel like, you know, this is actually not uh, thick, it's, you want it to be a little more thicker, and then your and then your soap is finished and you want it to be a little thicker so you can actually add so i forgot uh, to uh, i didn't press the thing so i forgot to mention i added glycerin um oil to this you can also add glycerin oil you remember we added some um products that will be drying off the skin to be able to peel it off so it's important that we mix you add also uh, um, products that will also keep the skin soft as it peels the salicylic acid and the glycolic acid and the other lactic acid they're going to dry off the skin so that it can peel off so if the skin is too if the product is too dry it can tear you or it can make you feel uncomfortable so it's important actually i added just some few drops, but can still add more drop in your presence. So it's important for you to add some exfoliating, uh, some um, sorry, uh, ingredients. Not make it too oily. Don't make too much oil so that it can you can also enjoy the uh, the foaming benefits. But still add like I added the alantion, which is going to help to moisturize, keep it moisturized. Added vitamin E and the glycerin oil as well, and the bamboo uh, serum that we added just to make sure that the skin is well moisturized and well softened even as it peels do you understand that so um yeah now i was saying something if you want let's assume you feel oh this thing is too light i want it a little more thick for me like this is not a problem I like it this way but just for illustration papers I want to show you guys as well what you can do if this um, product looks a little light to you so this is uh, Xantagon this is called Xantagon this is Xantagon powder I don't mind it uh, don't, don't have space to show you guys so Oh, sorry guys good when two hands are busy so I just added one teaspoon of this to the mixture the Xantagon oh my god I hope I'm using two hands to hold things I didn't remember to press it oh. so this will help to Hold the thickness of the soap together. is it for this recipe guys that is it for this recipe you see how beautiful it is now it feels thicker and now you can enjoy your beautiful sexy sushi squeezy slimy <laughs> slimy soap <laughs> I think I got a name. Sexy, sassy, squishy, slimy soap. <laughs> this name is sweet. So that is it. That's what I was looking for. This name is very beautiful. You see? Oh, babes. You can be very smart and creative. <laughs> I just got the name. <laughs> so... This is it, guys. I hope you guys love this very soap. I hope you want to try it out. I'll be giving this to somebody. Maybe probably if you're, 
if you buy me if you call me and buy something from me before the soup runs out i'm gonna be giving you one of this just for your own enjoyment just for you to enjoy it <laughs> just for you to enjoy it all right so i'll show you guys the next as soon as i'm done so guys we are done and we're gonna sterilize this okay doesn't it look beautiful i think sorry mommy i think it looks very beautiful i think it looks really 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 sexy so this is I'm not talking to you, Kion. I'm talking to my... Okay, you are honey. Oh, sorry. I talked to you. Sorry. I, I called you honey. I know you're not honey. You are Kiona. You are Princess Kiona. So, guys, don't mind how... This is our beautiful soap. And it looks beautiful. This soap, you can make it to start up a small business. Trust me. You can. You can. And people will rush this soap. Trust me. People will rush this soap. When I wait for Nigeria... When I get plenty benefits, people will rush the soap. Trust me. Okay? So, hope you enjoy the video and give it a big, I want a big, big, very big thumbs up and share this video. Invite your friends, tell them to join my platform, tell them to join this channel because there's a lot we want to be giving out on this very channel. It's going to help all of us grow together. Thank you very much and please be sure to subscribe. If you have not subscribed, please kindly change your mind and subscribe and click on the notification button so that you can be always notified when I upload my new videos. And I love you guys. You guys are amazing. Thank you for watching. Stay blessed. She don't come, madam. Don't come.